Hello guys, welcome back to this channel. Hope everyone is fine. On that note, let's start this video. So this is week 10 assignment of the course blockchain and its applications. So guys, for the past five years, we have been giving solutions for various NPTEL courses. So for this reason also, we are posting these videos for the, especially for this course blockchain and its applications. So I tried my best to give you the most accurate solutions guys. If there are any changes to be made according to your opinion, you can please give your particular answer in the comment section but i think almost all solutions are correct if there is any changes that come to my notice then definitely i will update in the comment section guys so uh, please watch the video till then without skipping if you skip the video and if i change any make any solution in between you may not be able to note that so do watch full video guys and don't skip the video and if you are new to our channel please subscribe our channel like this video and definitely share that with your friends and classmates guys and they will also be able to access solutions like you so let's see the first question Which of the following statements is true for PBFT? Choose the best possible answer. So for first question, the correct answer is option C. It is not possible to create multiple pseudonymous identities to subvert the 3F plus 1 requirements for PBFT. So mark option C as correct answer for first question so option C next next second question is second question Alice has an account in the Ethereum network and wants to transfer ETH to Bob who has an account in the Bitcoin network is it possible to do so So for second question, the answer is option C guys. Yes, he can do that. It is possible via a trusted third party. Trusted third party. So mark option C guys. Next third question. Third one. Which of the following denotes properties of hashed time lock contracts? So for third question, the answer is option B guys. Spending of fund is blocked till the secret is publicly revealed or timeout occurs. So mark option B as the probable solution for third question. option b next fourth one guys one of the advantages of centralized ttp based asset transfer is it is very secure and always considered reliable is this true or false statement so before getting to know this solution i want to make an announcement guys so for the course blockchain and its applications so we have prepared the exam preparation mcqs guys so with five years of NPTEL experience, we have prepared this. So here you'll get a huge number of 300 MCQs. No other channel is providing MCQs, guys. Only our channel is providing this huge number of 300 MCQs in a Google Drive PDF form. So these are the combination of previous year assignment questions as well as our own, own handmade, handmade question, guys. So hand curated questions plus the previous year assignment questions. So for one person, it is just 300 rupees only. 300 MCQs, 300 rupees for single person. Last time we have sold it for 500 rupees. In order to reduce burden on students, we have decreased the price from 500 to just 300 rupees. So 300 MCQs, 300 rupees for one person. And if you take it as a group, you can even reduce the individual amount. So for if you take it as group of two to five persons, it is combinedly 500 per group. So if you are, if any, any one of your classmates or if some of your classmates or your friends doing the same course along with you, then you can form a group of two to five persons and you take it directly for 500 among and you can share among yourself. So you can even reduce the amount individually. Even if you are one person, no need to worry guys, we have reduced the price to just 300 rupees only. Already many students have taken last year also guys and they got benefited. And this year also many students have taken our pack and already started preparing guys. So take it now itself because you'll get more time to 
revise at the end so for one person it is 300 rupees and for two to five person it is 500 rupees guys so this is the mail id if you want to purchase then this is the mail id you have to mail me to this email id and ask for the particular subject you want and how many persons access you want so remember guys only if you want to purchase then only mail me guys for any other doubts you can ask me in the youtube comment section itself so i will once again show you the email id guys it is pk179417 this is the mail id i'll give the same email id in the description box as well so this is the mail id guys So and there is second pack that is just a sample YouTube membership pack guys. Here you will go only get 100 MCQs, 100 plus MCQs. So for one person it is just 89 rupees and only available in video format for one month only guys. So if you want this YouTube sample pack just go to our channel page, YouTube channel page, S Kumar Edu. So there you will find a join button beside the subscribe button there is a join button right. So click on that and a window will be appear like this. So select the second pack here, the second one, 89 per month pack and again click on join and make payment directly to YouTube, not me. Then you will become member of our channel and you can get access to all of our members only videos. Here you can see members only sec videos section available. So here you can see blockchain and its applications part 2 and part 1 also prepared. So you can purchase this case. And you can get access to all these videos for the same 89 rupees only. No extra charge needed. So that is the youtube membership pack guys but my suggestion is it's better to take this 300 mcqs pack because you are getting almost covered for all the week syllabus here but in youtube sample pack you'll only cover few weeks only and mcqs also very less just 100 mcqs but the price is also less guys so you can if you want you can take this 18 membership and also both these two memberships because you can cover one subject perfectly almost perfectly for this in this pdf pack and if you are uh, preparing for multiple subjects that we have uploaded in the members only section you can take this pack so it will be useful for multiple subjects and this is useful for in-depth preparation so it both will be useful but if you want to purchase the pdf you have to mail me guys you can you should ask for the payment process for that but if you want this youtube membership no need to ask me no need to mail me you can directly go to our youtube channel page and pay directly to youtube company itself guys that's it guys so now let's get back to the solutions so for fourth question so it is very secure uh, and always considered reliable about centralized ttp based asset transfer so it is absolutely false statement guys so mark option b as the correct option that is false option b false next fifth question guys what are some of the issues that exist in asset exchange so for fifth question all these three options are correct only guys synchronization problem among sender and receiver networks agreement of exchange rates and denial of service so all these three are correct that means option d all of the above is the correct option next sixth one what is an escrow select the best possible and concrete answer what is an escrow So sixth question, if you see the first option, this is the correct one guys. Escrow is an ag agreement in which assets are held and distributed when conditions are met. So mark option A guys. Option A. Next, seventh one. Seventh one. Which of the following are guaranteed in the ideal atomic swap protocol? So for seventh question, we have two options guys. The first one is option A. All swaps will take place only when all parties conform to the protocol. That is the first option. And the other one is option 
see guys no collision has an incentive to deviate from the protocol so these two are the correct answers for seventh question guys that is option a as well as option c guys next eighth one eighth question Can Alice send one BTC to her own account using a time locked contract? Is that possible or not? So the answer is option B. Yes, she can send to her own account. There is no problem in that. So mark option B, guys. Next, ninth one. Ninth question. Suppose Alice has a time locked contract with the target account as like this. So funding contract one Bitcoin and hash they have given and timeout also they have given. So what will happen if Alice refuses to reveal the key and timeout occurs? So for ninth question the answer is option A guys one Bitcoin refunded to Alice. So mark option A guys. And moving on to the final question of this assignment, that is 10th one. Which of the following is used as a public permission ledger based DID registry? So before getting to know this solution, I want to once again make you remember guys. So for the course blockchain and its applications, we have prepared the exam preparation MCQs guys with 5 years of NPTEL experience. So you, here you are getting a huge number of 300 MCQs within a Google Drive PDF link. No other channel is providing that only our channel is doing that case. So 300 huge number of MCQs you are going to get for one person. It is just 300 rupees only guys. If you have a group of two to five students, if your friends or classmates are, are doing the same course parallelly, you can two, two to five members of your group can form a group as a group and you can combinedly get it for 500 per the group guys. So you can if suppose if you are five persons, you can share that 500 among yourself. So for each person 100 on, for rupees 100 you are getting each one is getting 300 mcqs right so if you form a group you can get it for 500 combinedly guys even if you are one person no need to worry you, you are getting that for 300 only last time the price actually is 500 rupees in order to reduce burden on students we have reduced the price from one person uh, access from 500 to 300 rupees only guys so this is the mail id guys you have to mail me so I'll give the same email ID in the description box as well. So this is the mail ID guys. And there is YouTube sample pack. You can go to our channel page and purchase the membership of 89 rupees. You'll get video format only. But my suggestion is it's better to take this 300 MCQs exam preparation oriented pack. So already many students have taken guys and also started pre preparing from now itself. So you also take it as fast as possible. Discuss this with your friends and message me to this email ID guys. So now let's get back to the final solution. So with 10th question, which of the following is used as a public permission ledger based DIT registry? So for 10th and final question, the answer is option A, hyperledger in D. Hyperledger in D. So mark option A as correct answer for 10th question, guys. So friends, these are the solutions for week 10 assignment of I, uh, blockchain and its applications course so hope this video helpful for you if you feel the same please subscribe our channel like this video and definitely share that with your friends and classmates guys and don't forget to take this 300 mcqs pack so it will be very very helpful for you in the preparation for the final exam so you'll get a google drive pdf link which has huge a huge number of 300 mcqs so for one person it is 300 rupees and for two to five persons combinedly it is 500 rupees guys so this is my mail id if you want to if you want to purchase then only mail me guys so this is the mail id so that's it guys so keep supporting us like this and please share that with this video with your friends and classmates and form form a group of students and purchase this 300 mcq spec guys even if you are one person no problem you are getting for 300 only so that's it guys so keep supporting us like this so until the next video goodbye thank you